Hi guys, it's Chrissy with Chrissy's Divine Design Tarot, and today we are doing a reading for the collective. Oh yeah! Now the collective is any one of the zodiac signs can resonate with this message. So let's have a look at what is your energy between the both of you here. I'm going to do two cards. I'm going to crack the deck and then we're going to look at the bottom. Okay, embrace through each other. You find the missing pieces and freedom. There's nothing stopping you. The path is clear if you want it to be. So this is a matter of making maybe a choice here. Really feeling about your partner. What are you really feeling about your partner? Let's see. Courage. Okay, that maybe they're gaining courage. I find the inner strength to face fear with confidence. Nice. Okay, so feeling a little confident here. And imagination. I embrace and nourish the creative aspect of my mind. Nice so definitely has an imagination so that's how you really feel about your partner so they have an imagination oh and look at what came out as yes, passion ignited this is the greatest strength of the relationship <laughs> is that passion okay <laughs> and disruption here okay so maybe there is a disruption that's going on here number seven is reflecting and assessing maybe learning something um, and there's also spirituality there so oh, maybe figuring out something spiritually here mm hmm let's see what's the biggest challenge you've gone through okay balance uh, keeping things balanced and what about wisdom okay so Maybe there was something that you didn't know about that was disrupting your balance here. Let's see here. Maybe you didn't know about balance when it came to spirituality. What do you need from your partner? Let's see. Oh, maybe some alone time or needing to assess things and there might be a regeneration so this may be somebody from your past that somebody from an ending here with the number 10 so this is regenerating something here there was growth it might be somebody wanting to reconcile maybe they have to come towards you ah yeah they need to release something or you do and they need to give the truth. They need to release to you the truth. So maybe there was some lies here in this connection. What steps do you need to take to tighten the bond here? Let's see. This was supposed to be the next one. And then we got spirit's advice. So, and what the spirit says about the connection oh this could be a new love so there's some contemplating here on some new growth so this could be seen as a new love a new person has stirred your romantic feelings or this could be a past person and it's just a new phase in your relationship or a new cycle let's see what's on the bottom of the deck getting to know one another Hmm. So really getting to know one another as you reveal your innermost selves to one another, your bond deepens. And what is spirit saying about all this? Be willing to forgive. So this may be somebody from your past. Maybe there is a new person coming in or maybe you're needing to forgive self. Okay. So perhaps you're being really hard on yourself about something here. And we have, you are a powerful light worker. It is safe for you to be powerful. Your spiritual power begins or brings great blessings in loving service to the divine. So perhaps you're in your purpose here. Wow, that's, that's wonderful. Let's see here. You may have had the courage to get this off the ground here using your imagination of some type of passionate thing you're wanting to do here okay so we have the four of wands in reverse 
But that's okay because this maybe is a lack mindset you had at one point uh, or some type of disconnect. And I feel like you have the freedom here. You embraced it and you freed yourself from this here. So in order to come, but in order for you two to come together, this energy, you maybe both had some of this here between the both of you this is your energy between the both of you so you you may have embraced whatever it was about yourself that you needed to let go of and uh, you both may have done the, that type of work here because this is something you share for energy now how do you really feel about your partner the courage and imagination you may have um look up to this person yeah you're willing to plant those seeds with this person Okay, they may disrupt your uh, passionate thoughts or this is a great a greatest strength in the relationship here is they may be able to disrupt things or you may feel they're being <laughs> disruptive <laughs> whenever they might I, I see what's going on here. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime you work and they come in, maybe you work from home, and I feel like you may you may not see them as disruptive. They just might be. You might be very passionate for this person. So whenever they come into the room, you kind of lock eyes with each other, and things go from there. <laughs> Everything else is kind of put down or um, I kind of dropped <laughs> to be with each other. I feel like it's just a, an energy thing that pulls you together and I feel like it's you can't let that disrupt whatever you're trying to do for your purpose but I feel like it's something that can't be helped. <laughs> Let's see what comes up for this. Ah yes you're no longer you guys are going to be no longer um, <laughs> single after this passionate stuff begins with you two. I feel like it cannot be helped. It's like you're drawn to one another. Let's see. Who is this balance and wisdom? This was your greatest challenge you've gone through. You've learned a lot of things. Yeah, it was because somebody broke your heart. Now, not necessarily this person. But this may have been something you've gone through on your own. Maybe your person has as well. Maybe you have something in common. You learned a lot. Uh, and you learned how to balance yourself, I feel like. Whatever disruption happened here with this, I feel like whatever heartbreak this was, you've, you've learned to let it go. Uh, maybe uh, even forgive. You've balanced your energy out here. And learned a lot from this. There's growth here. What does your partner need from you? Maybe you need to think about things. Maybe you're growing still here. You're. I feel like you're still assessing things. Learning. You know, may not be ready for this person just yet. Let's see. Go to the sea and regeneration. What's that about? <laughs> Yeah, somebody's coming in or wanting to go move forward here with something. And you may need to take more time. I'm getting growth takes time. You might, This regeneration of yourself, you might be finding yourself. Let's see, what's this release and truth? Oh, wow. <laughs> Maybe you need to be truthful with yourself in a sense that how you feel about this person this is a blessing this is a love blessing look at that oh my god <laughs> she's like new love ten of panic or ten of cubs this is like fairy tale stuff you know getting to know each other wow this is beautiful being willing to forgive yourself maybe there's something you're being hard on yourself about yeah, you're you're going to um, celebrate here whatever this birth of this new beginning that you have here with this person. It's on the bottom of the deck. Yeah, you're going to take that leap of faith. Oh, yeah, I like that. Okay, so whatever you both have done here in your energy, 
you've embraced whatever this was and you freed yourself from whatever it was sorry about the noise yeah this has to do with love this is to find your person possibly here this is to find that love oh somebody's been watching you they're sending that message they don't want you to be single yeah there was some type of somebody got caught in the act of something here because this was your biggest challenge you've gone through and you learned a lot about somebody uh, cheating perhaps they got caught the, trying to hide something or do something deceptive and I feel like you've learned how to balance those things out now from this heartbreak what does your partner need from you well let's see to come forward oh and plan the future so you're needing to have this person come in for you maybe you have been looking forward to this blessing coming in i feel like you are looking for truth look at that there is your offer with the king of cups here and yeah look at that with the four of pentacles now this is after tarot right so this has to do with saving some money having stability maybe fixed on wealth or maybe just being kind of possessive with you or you're being possessive with this new person kind of feel like you both want to be around each other let's see here yeah look at that there's that leap of faith nobody wants to be the fool here wow isn't that beautiful let's see ah there's that financial blessing as well we have a love blessing and a financial blessing oh my goodness this is so beautiful well guys that's what i have for you so please like share and subscribe become part of the tribe and if you want to donate you can donate below in the description box there with the paypal account and if you want to you can do the super thanks and just watching the videos certainly helps the channel and i adore all of you i appreciate all of your support no matter how you wish to give it and <laughs> yeah i i do have some donations that i've received so i will be putting another order in for some cards and I appreciate that from you all. You guys rock. <laughs> all right, guys. Take care. Stay blessed. Later.